Animals that use tools. People once thought that only humans can use tools. Now, scientists are finding out that many animals can also use tools. Macaque monkeys. If you go to a Buddhist temple in l a p b u r i Thailand, watch out for the macaque monkeys. They may come to you and pull out your hair. They use human hair to floss their teeth. If you are lucky, you may see female monkeys that are teaching flossing to their babies. While the babies are watching, the female monkeys floss their teeth very slowly. This way, the baby monkeys learn to floss. Octopuses. People don't usually think that octopuses are smart. However, octopuses are very smart and they can also use tools. They use coconut shells for protection. When they can't find a good hiding place, they hide under coconut shells. Some octopuses even store coconut shells for later use. They pile the coconut shells and carry them to use later. How smart! Crows. In Aesop's fable, The Thirsty Crow, a crow drops stones into a jar to raise the level of water. You may think this is just a story, but it is not. Scientists who were studying crows did an experiment. They put a jar with water in front of a crow. A worm was floating on top of the water. However, The water level was low, so the crow could not eat the worm. The crow solved the problem, just as in the fable. It drops stones into the jar. If you think this bird is special, you're wrong. Scientists did the same experiment with other crows, and they all did the same too. Animals that use tools. Animals that use tools. Animals that use tools. People once thought that only humans can use tools. People once thought that only humans can use tools. People once thought that only humans can use tools. Now, scientists are finding out that many animals can also use tools. Now, scientists are finding out that many animals can also use tools. Now, scientists are finding out that many animals can also use tools. Macaque monkeys. Macaque monkeys. Macaque monkeys. If you go to a Buddhist temple in l a p b u r i Thailand, watch out for the macaque monkeys. If you go to a Buddhist temple in l a p b u r i Thailand, watch out for the macaque monkeys. If you go to a Buddhist temple in l a p b u r i Thailand, watch out for the macaque monkeys.
They may come to you and pull out your hair. They may come to you and pull out your hair. They may come to you and pull out your hair. They use human hair to floss their teeth. They use human hair to floss their teeth. They use human hair to floss their teeth. If you are lucky, you may see female monkeys that are teaching flossing to their babies. If you are lucky, you may see female monkeys that are teaching flossing to their babies. If you are lucky, you may see female monkeys that are teaching flossing to their babies. While the babies are watching, the female monkeys floss their teeth very slowly. While the babies are watching, the female monkeys floss their teeth very slowly. While the babies are watching, the female monkeys floss their teeth very slowly. This way, the baby monkeys learn to floss. This way, the baby monkeys learn to floss. This way, the baby monkeys learn to floss. Octopuses 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 People don't usually think that octopuses are smart. People don't usually think that octopuses are smart. People don't usually think that octopuses are smart. However, octopuses are very smart and they can also use tools. However, octopuses are very smart and they can also use tools. However, octopuses are very smart and they can also use tools. They use coconut shells for protection. They use coconut shells for protection. They use coconut shells for protection. When they can't find a good hiding place, they hide under coconut shells.
When they can't find a good hiding place, they hide under coconut shells. When they can't find a good hiding place, they hide under coconut shells. Some octopuses even store coconut shells for later use. Some octopuses even store coconut shells for later use. Some octopuses even store coconut shells for later use. They pile the coconut shells and carry them to use later. They pile the coconut shells and carry them to use later. They pile the coconut shells and carry them to use later. How smart! How smart! How smart! Crows. 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 In Aesop's fable, the thirsty crow, a crow drops stones into a jar to raise the level of water. In Aesop's fable, the thirsty crow, a crow drops stones into a jar to raise the level of water. In Aesop's fable, the thirsty crow, a crow drops stones into a jar to raise the level of water. You may think this is just a story, but it is not. You may think this is just a story, but it is not. You may think this is just a story, but it is not. Scientists who were studying crows did an experiment. Scientists who were studying crows did an experiment. Scientists who were studying crows did an experiment. They put a jar with water in front of a crow. They put a jar with water in front of a crow. They put a jar with water in front of a crow. A worm was floating on top of the water. A worm was floating on top of the water. A worm was floating on top of the water. However, 
The water level was low, so the crow could not eat the worm. However, the water level was low, so the crow could not eat the worm. However, the water level was low, so the crow could not eat the worm. The crow solved the problem just as in the fable. The crow solved the problem just as in the fable. The crow solved the problem just as in the fable. It drops stones into the jar. It drops stones into the jar. It drops stones into the jar. If you think this bird is special, you're wrong. If you think this bird is special, you're wrong. If you think this bird is special, you're wrong. Scientists did the same experiment with other crows, and they all did the same too. Scientists did the same experiment with other crows, and they all did the same too. Scientists did the same experiment with other crows, and they all did the same too.